What is happening YouTube, your boy Tech back with another video and today I'm gonna show you the brand new things and what I love about TVOS 13. Here we go. First things first, make sure to hit that subscribe button below, hit that notification bell so you can be notified on the next videos to come. Check out my merch below at 1130.ca. As you already know, Apple released the iOS 13, iPadOS 13, and right now we're looking at the tvOS 13. There are so many features that Apple added on to the tvOS 13, and today we're going to show you those features and what I love about them. The first feature that I like about what Apple added on the tvOS is the new UI. It's a dynamic UI now. And basically what it is, is you just hover over the app that you want to go into. As long as they're in the front row, you will be able to see a preview of that app. The second feature that Apple added is Apple Arcade. Right now, we won't be able to see the actual Apple Arcade because it's not out yet. But once Apple release Apple Arcade, we will be able to play games using DualShock 4 or an Xbox One S controller. The next feature that Apple added on the Apple TV, which I am very excited about, is the multi-user account. Same as how we have it on Netflix and also on our Macs. You will be able to see only the things that you have watched. You don't have to share the home screen with your family now. Now you can customize your own and personalize it to yourself. I feel like the tvOS just catching up to iOS. So basically, this is the multitasking feature that Apple added to tvOS 13. And basically, you'll be able to preview the other apps that you've used in the past on your multitasking windows. Now let's look at the settings and the build number for this beta version. That would be 17J5485S. Another feature that Apple added to tvOS 13 is taken from the iOS devices and that is Control Center. This is where you're going to see the different users, also the sleep and the now playing. Now you can have the AirPlay button as well there where you can AirPlay to different speakers at home that you have, especially HomePods. Another awesome feature that Apple added to tvOS 13 is screen savers. This is probably one of the best features that I like about Apple TVs is having different locations around the globe. And Apple have done such a great job of this, having screen savers for your Apple TV. They capture stunning shots of beautiful places in the world. And I think that's amazing you'll be able to appreciate the places around the globe. Now, the next feature that we're going to look at is the music app. Apple released a brand new music app for the Apple TV, which has a lot of features added into it. You guys go ahead and uh, check that out and uh, play around with the app itself. But basically, the favorite thing that I have for this, the best thing that they added is the karaoke. So basically, once you play music, it'll show you the lyrics uh, step by step as it plays. You could then use that to sing along with your favorite tunes. Other features that added on the music app is airplay to different speakers, especially from Apple TV to Apple TV. Now, there's so many features that Apple added to the tvOS 13, and we've only seen only a few and you guys need to check it out um, if you want to download the apple tv os 13 without a developer's account i'll link that down below or you can click up there on the cards menu it will be up there as well but basically we have to go through a lot of things on the tv os 13 there's so much more and let me know in the comments below what you are excited about on the tvOS 13. I hope to see you guys next time on the next video. And I hope you guys have a good day and stay grateful. Peace.